Hello, this is going to be a review of the Elite Force Type 19. Okay, starting off, what comes in the gun? Um, in the package, it comes with the gun. Comes with the gun. Um, you have your mag right here. Okay, then you have uh, you got uh, you got um, you got the airsoft gun registration. You got uh, UMRX. Uh, do not return this product to the store. You got Elite Force. From front line, then you got the manual for the fucking dumbasses. Okay, so now let's get into the gun. This gun does have a threaded barrel, so you can insert a suppressor that fell, but you did not insert it for the video. Also, one thing is it's metal, so it's not going to fuck up on you and snap when you're in combat. Another thing is mag holds 14 rounds shoot you can shoot about two mags of these of these uh co2 co2 does not come with the gun you got to buy separate Do not forget when you're ordering this gun let's put the mag aside okay okay another thing is it has a bolt catch very nice safety and be dexterous you can do it on both sides since it's tactical it has a bigger tail yes it has a skeleton uh, hammer it has a skeleton trigger yes it has white sights here for the fucking blind okay now about the grips we got a grip on the front just like we would have on a real one but back here which does come with two you got the tactical rail for your flashlights or whatever you want to put on there and um the, it consists of full metal the only plastic parts you'll really see on this is uh it's probably on the mag is this right here which i might think they upgraded in the 2013 version over here this is plastic though so be careful if you break that, it's a pain in the ass to get back. The FPS on this gun is about 340-330. It's, uh, it's been upgraded in um, 2013 because it's been lower, not upward. Because when the gun first came out in 2012, the, the, the FPS was too high. It did not reach field limits. So Elite Force listened to us and toned it down in 2013. They also gave us this was very high quality polymer. Now is very high, very high uh, metal. Yes, metal. Um, yes, so that's it. Oh, one more thing. Blowback. Ha ha ha. No more CO2. Okay, let's give it a second try with new CO2 cartridge. Blow back. You have to pull the hammer down first. Very realistic for you dumbasses who use springers and don't know. Ready? Now, another cool feature is when you run out of ammo, just like you see in movies, James Bond, all them. This over here slides back and locks into place like that. You want to take your mag out once you do that. Shoot safety. Then insert the mag. That has been a review of the D Force 1911. Thank you for watching and uh, go fuck yourself. Why are you fucking still recording? You fuck!